the same. My way was even better. I feel like you did. No. Check this out, though. Oh. Oh, oh no, look, right there. We're going to get lighted whips so that we can wire them and install them. Giveaway time! Don't forget, we're giving away a pair of LED ox beam headlights like we installed in Boosty. The link to the video and official rules, everything you need to know, is going to be below. So check it out! Okay, what's going on, Danny? What's going on? Um, what's going on is, so we don't really, here's the thing. Where we live, uh, we, can't, we can't just go riding down the street in a field. Uh, there are no riding spots for us. There's no OHV that's very close, except for out in the desert. And we kind of, we could have gone. We could have already made a trip out to the desert, but now unfortunately it is just way too hot. So what we're doing right now is just focusing on getting the car ready for the next trip, right? Exactly. So um, one thing that we didn't get to was we didn't get to finish wiring up the lighted whips. So we're gonna do that today. But before we can do that, we have to go get them because they're in the trailer. Uh, okay, so we're at storage. Uh, we need to get something. Check this out, though. Oh, oh no, look, right there. Look at that. Wow. Somebody doesn't care for their Can-Am. Right. That's a brand no, new... No that's, cover, no nothing? That's a 2020 RR. It's like leaving your dog in a freaking car with the windows rolled up. It's horrible. Horrible. Yes. Not judging you if this is your uh, car, but it's, you know, it's an expensive car. It's expensive. All right, we'll be right back. We're gonna go find this trailer. We'll get the lighter whips. We'll take you along with us. I can't find it. I was looking for a flag with Dandy Off Road on it, but. It's not out here. At least somebody took it. Somebody took it for sure. What's going on up there? I'm stealing this flag. Okay, we captured the flag. We captured it, now we're stealing it, taking it home. Look at what we found. Ooh. Right there. Oh, hey! As Brandy would say. <laughs> All right, Sorry, we'll Brandy. be right back. All right, we got these. Ooh, so we're gonna slide them right there. there. All right. Yeah. Can we go down the beach? Yeah. Got plenty of room. Ta-da! All right, let's go mount these things. All right, what's going on, Danny? What's going on, everybody? What are we doing? We are honestly, yeah, lagging around until we start working on these whips. I have too many. It's been a long day. Icy pops, so it's not. It's already wired. I mean, technically, it's already wired for lighted whips, right? We got the switch right there. Somewhere right there. Somewhere. Right there, I see it. I see it. Do you see it? Excuse the water cooler noise. Uh, it's too hot. We have to have it. It just, it just it has to be. There's no options, right? Exactly. Um, and there's wiring up in there that we're going to have to get to and uh, extend or do whatever we have to do. Uh, they ha we are wired for lighted whips. We're going to pull that mount off. This one's staying, and the reason this one stays is we use this uh, flag for our big dandy off road flag. We're going to keep that. We're going to have one big one, two small ones on the lighted whips. That's just how it is. All right? Sure. All right. So, <laughs> so we're going to go put the flags on first. We'll be right back. Where did you get this? Freedom Ropes. Jerk Pirates. Danny Off Roaders United. Danny and Leah. Danny and Leah. Yeah, thank you very much. They're so awesome. I mean, the flags are awesome too. But anyway, we're gonna we're gonna put yeah we're gonna put these on our lighter whips. All right. Exactly. All right, here we go. Yes. So here's here's what Danny says. He says pull off this red chip and this. This slide the flag out. Seems ridiculous to me. Look at how much of a wasted light whip there is. Wow, that is a lot, huh? But you're gonna have a place for flag. We're gonna cover up even more, a little bit. I think I'm gonna go ahead and, I did this with my, some of my other ones, I'm gonna open this up, because I have zip tied these on before and had them come off anyway. I I've seen it, this one. So I'm gonna open this up right here, slide it on, and then we're also gonna zip tie it on. Wait then. And then we're gonna put this on. And we're not gonna put this on. You don't like the little red tip? Well, I do. It just really keeps, you know. 
It just keeps taking away from the light of wit more and more, right? I didn't know what it would have been. Well, let's do this. Let's slice this open, slide it on, see what it looks like. I'm sure. There's probably going to be like 47 different better ways to do this. We'll find out when the comments start. But that's all right. We're okay with that. I think this is more of a out west thing because I don't think back east they fly flags very as much as we do. These are required in sand dunes. Not as many rules. Not as many rules, not as many sand dunes. Danny threw the instructions away. And it's just a bad habit. I brought it. Chip, and then we'll zip tie it around the red tip. Yeah. Yeah. Or if you want to go really oh, zip tie no. it in that way, he really wants that red tip to be shown. No, I don't. Or you can take it. It is. It's kind of. It's just kind of like a little safety build that keeps sliding. Yeah, it, it'll be there either way. I was just gonna around it. I, I like that. I figured if you went like underneath it, yeah. it would kind of help slide. Yeah, but the zip tie below the rubber. Yeah. 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 That's what you said. I got it. Yeah, it's like, okay, we'll be right back. Okay, first things first. Is this light in your way? Can you see? I can see. Okay, first things first. I gotta, when this broke loose and stuff, I didn't want to short, get it shorted out. So I kind of zip tied everything up here so we can cut all this loose. Let's see what the carnage actually is. I don't remember. This one's not part of the deal. I'm gonna cut this loose for now. I'll put it back later. So we can get to everything. Yeah, that's where I wanted it. All right, so here is our wiring for our lighted whip. Uh, looks like power only. We gotta figure out how. I think it was just grounded uh, from the, you know, from the five mount itself. But here is. Here's a lighted wet power feed right there. Uh, and then it ties off. Because uh, we got a couple things. We got one feed goes to the backup camera, one goes to lighted wit. And then another one, so there's two going inside this tube, going across, one goes to the other lighted wit, one goes to the camera, and one goes to this lighted wit. Or the lighted wit that used to be right here. That this is all. This is by the way, this is all that's left of that lighted whip. Are, our uh, Sapos, I like them. We bought them in 2015. They 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 went about I don't know. I want to say 5,000 miles, four or 5,000 miles with us in the sand. So I think what we're gonna do, I'm not sure what we're gonna do. We'll be right back. Okay, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna cut this off. I'm gonna go get some. Uh, Get something, get some heat chain, but we're gonna zip tie this back up like this. We're gonna bring this wire, we're gonna bring it through here, somehow sneak it into this. Oh, underneath. Oh, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do that and we're gonna bring it underneath and then into this. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> yep, yep. All right, we're gonna extend this first and we'll go from there. All right. I thought we were ready, but we're not. We'll be right back because we need to plug in the solder. All right, here we are. We had to get some of this. I want to use some of this stuff. It looks cool. I need some of this stuff because it's wired. This wire's not long enough because you know it wasn't. It wasn't wired for this. It was wired for this, and not you now this happened and not that happened. So look at these. I use these. I've had these in about 27 years. They were my dad's. Can still work? Not very well, but I have been using these all my life, so I just, they just, I try to use other stuff in the me. These, yeah. So we're gonna put some heat shrink tubing on this first. Yes. So we're gonna put some heat shrink tubing on this first. We're gonna find the red right size and the right color. Actually, we don't really care what color because it's gonna get covered up. But I wanna use black if I have black. In the rest of the ice, we're going to need some white because it is going to get covered up with some other stuff. Good enough? Good enough. Good enough. 
I'll just throw both on the ground. Okay. Let's try this again. On the longer side, so we keep it away from the heat. Go down there. We're gonna put these together. My lighting situation is not ideal. It works. Except that it's more shiny in my lights. My lights? It's more shiny in my lights than my eyes. <laughs> right? Heat up the gun. I also use a gun. An old, old gun. Because I do. Because it works? Yeah. That's the dude. So we're gonna get it good and hot. We're not giving a soldering lesson here. So if I'm doing it wrong, just know that I'm okay. Just don't try to check out that you've been soldering. How am I gonna know if it's hot or not? happen there. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna put our heat shrink tubing over that so you guys can't see it. Ooh, that's, some, that's some sensitive heat shrink tubing. It already started doing its thing. Alright, again that's why it's gonna get covered up so we don't care. Alright, now we're gonna extend this about half of 17 miles. That way we are not, we don't run out of water. We're just gonna go way over here. That should be more than enough. Alright, now we're gonna actually calculate how much wire we do need because we're gonna cover this with some uh, other stuff. And we're gonna tie it up all clean and like that. This is gonna come under here. And so, I'm gonna say. Don't remember to account for the plug. Huh? Remember to account for the plug? Yeah. I mean, that should be way more than enough, right? All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some of this stuff. I like this stuff, it looks cool. And we're gonna cover all of this. And then we're gonna zip tie it up and then all nice and clean. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay, it's, it's, it's kind of a, now it's kind of hard because you know, you, you use it like this and the end frays out, but if you burn the end, it doesn't fray out. But if you burn the end, then it won't, you can't get it to expand. You know what I mean. Somebody does. Sure. This stuff is kind of a pain. Oh, you know, that soldering iron is still freaking hot. Oh, yeah, did you touch your elbow to it? Yeah. yeah I don't do that. Try to get a better angle. So. I think I'm fine right here. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we'll come back. Let's let's get this on soon. This, this is painful. Okay, so we fed this stuff over the whole wire all the way back to this, which, which yeah, we had a mess. But we cleaned it up. We made it look clean by doing that. Now we're going to zip tie the end of this so it doesn't come loose. Then we're going to burn off the, um, the junk. This stuff is hard to work with. It looks cool, right? Yep. Alright. So, what that does is now... It gives us a nice, ouch, a nice, <laughs> a nice burn. It gives us a nice burn. It hurts. It burns. So it burns a lot, quite a bit. And so it gives us a nice clean line. Look at that. Nice and clean, uniform looking right here instead of all that other different strands of whatever we had going on. And we're going to put that up in there. That will get zip tied all together in there. This will drop down like that. Also zip tied. Boom, it'll come out here. It'll come out. Um, Ground, I think we're gonna pull off the nut. Like a ring terminal, maybe. All right? Sure. And he says sure a lot. I did my new. You did? I ran positive and negative. From where? Battery. Oh. Just switch. Yeah. I mean, which is good. I mean, ground's everywhere on the car. Hot. Yeah. Absolutely. I didn't say my way was any better. I feel like you do. No. Wow. Maybe come out right there. And then yep. put a chingus on. We'll put a ring terminal somewhere with some black black wire. Yep. So we'll figure out the ring terminal and we'll be right back so that we can run the ground and solder this all together and make it look all mm -hmm. Okay, here's what we're doing. Uh, had I planned this out 
a little better. I probably would have done this a little bit differently. I don't know, or maybe not. But I'm bringing a second wire into this strand. And uh, once I figure out where it is down here, I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to cut this, bring it out, because it's going to be the ground. All right? Right. True. So I'm going to cut into this right about here and bring that wire out. I like it. Look at that. So that's what we did. For our ground, we brought this. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. So then that will all be tucked in there. Boom. That's all that sticks out with the cave with the end on it. I like it. Perfect. I like it. All right. So let's go ahead and get some heat shrink tubing on the end of this. All right. Let's get it soldered up, of course. I'm going to wire up the hot side first uh, because I don't want to goof. But first, we need some of this. Quite a bit of this. We're gonna stick a bunch of this on the connector so we can uh, cover all this up. Come on down. Make it look all nice and neat and shiny and stuff. I'm gonna have to find a way to actually. Hold on, I'll be back. We'll be back. Okay, we're back. We got this handy, handy, handy device right here. I'll put that there. Yeah, and then if you're into smoking the ganja, you can be like... And we're going to do something like that. And then we're going to connect this wire right here. And stick this guy in here. Alright, here we go. We're going to start this up. What do you think, Danny? You know what I missed? Were you really going to let me do this? Huh? Yeah. Unbelievable. The cameraman was gonna let me fail. I just wanna have a video of what hunting. <laughs> well, you're about to get it. So, I'm gonna solder this up. Put the heat shrink tubing on it. Solder the other one up. Put heat shrink tubing all the way around both of them. Okay. So. Uh, over time, they kind of lose connection right here with these nuts, so if you kind of work them back and forth. But I'm just going to tell you right now, this is an electrical device. Don't ever do that. Unplug it. See how quick it heated up now? Alright, here we go. Does that? Let's put the heat shrink over it, and then we'll solder the other one. And I have a heat gun over there. We could totally be using the heat gun, but you know. the lighter wishes to do. Yeah, the lighter. The lighter does this. If you were doing a whole bunch of them, I mean, of course you'd probably want to use the heat gun instead. And when we're all done, the bigger piece will go out over both of these. Right, this is our ground wire. Pull it right there. Line it up. Strip it. Put it in our holder thingy, my jigger. This is a handy. Ooh. This is a handy device. I got this in the. I got this in the school for the electronics. All right, we're gonna solder that one. And I didn't put heat shrink on this one. Because, well, I mean, it's still short to that one, but we're, we're pretty covered, so I'm not going to worry about it. Or am I? I am. OCD? Shh, shh, shh. We don't know nothing. You don't know anything yeah. about me. So we added some heat shrink tubing down here that will slide over that connection. And this heat shrink tubing will go over all of it, including the end of the... I forget what this stuff is called. I just like the way it looks. Yeah, that gun's cooking now. Okay, so we're gonna put that heat shrink tube, the wipe over that. There's our two connections. It gets a little tricky when you're going from such a, you know, 
small gauge to a bigger gauge. But a bunch of heat shrink tubing cures it all. There we go. See, look at how clean that's going to be. Then we're going to bring this piece, send this piece back out like it should be. Put the ground through a little bit so it's even. Kind of like that. Then we'll bring this black heat shrink tubing over all of it, including the end of this. Uh, Whatever it's called, I forgot. I used to know the name. Um, like that. And then we'll keep this up. So it looks like now we got a ground coming out here. And whatever we have too much, we get chucked away under here. We'll bring our ground out right here onto our nut. Boom. Plug it in. Plug it in. Alright. Alright, okay, here's what we're gonna do. This is all we really have for a ring terminal. We don't want that yellow on there, of course. So what we're gonna do is we'll take that off, we're gonna solder our wire onto it. We're gonna put that ring terminal right here. We're going to put some black uh, heat shrink tubing as far up on it as we can and covering the wire. And yeah, that's what's going to happen right now. Um, we got to get this yellow guy off. Remember, <clears throat> I'm sure there's lots of other stuff we could use. But I'm doing what I always do, using what's in the garage. What's, what I have. So we're going to take this loose. Wrench. I have a wrench. Allen wrenches. It's weird. Now, that Allen wrenches. All right. So that fits right under that ring terminal. No problem. Uh, so now what we need to do is figure out about how long. This really doesn't need to stick out that far. We're not doing that on the bottom. On the bottom what? Either. Oh, this one? Yeah. Oh, hide it more, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we'll do that. But not until I put some heat shrink to you know. Ooh, whoopsie. I almost did. Or should I put some of this on to match? Because this will go way up on our way up on our dealie. Like so. On our ring terminal. And then onto our wire. And onto some of this stuff. So now we have a joint of this stuff, and we're gonna I'm just gonna burn the ends so it doesn't fray so bad. All right, I don't think that's going anywhere. Okay, Danny, are we on the right track? Soldered in place. We're gonna release the. We're gonna release the, the beast. Crack it. We're gonna cool this off because otherwise the heat shrink tubing is gonna start shrinking. All right. It's a clean look. Pretty clean look. So now we'll shrink this up. Look at that. All right? That's going to be hit under here on our bottom bolt. Ouch, that's hot. <laughs> this is what our other part looks like. The rest of this just zip ties up under here. We have we left some ser a service loop. <laughs> that's going to all be under there. That'll be tied up right there, like so. Like so. All right? Yep. Yes. I say yes. Yes.
Factory. We'll hit that later with the torqueometer. The torqueometer. I just realized we gotta go get the key because in a minute, in a minute here, we're gonna be able to fire up one lighted wick. And then we can find the right remote. That tucked in there good? Yeah. All right, I'm not gonna tuck that away yet because if we turn this on, it doesn't work for any reason. Yeah, that would be, huh? Yeah, so I'm gonna go get the key. I'll be right back. We'll try this out. Ooh, hey, it's green. It's green. So yeah, it's green. And uh, although I like green, I don't know that you know that's Danny's thing. Danny's green. We're black and red. Which you brought me two, and one of them you need back. Which two did you bring? I'd say the two these beat up ones are probably for you. Oh, look at that. Oh. Oh. Uh, -oh. <laughs> uh, you know what we gotta do? We gotta turn all the lights off. Here we go. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see. Hey, hey, we'll touch me there. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? Wow. Danny, Danny, come on, man. What's that about? Oh. oh. It was off, but it flashes. Hey. Pretty cool. Okay. I, I can't leave it running because we'll get malnutrition. Wow, I like the red. Okay, that's that's like brightest, brightest. Dennis. I like it. I like it. Alright, we're gonna turn the car off because we're gonna die now. Okay, so I think we got this finished up, right? What do you yes, think, guys? See it lit up again? Yeah. It, we, just we'll, be nice seeing it visible again. Yeah. We're, uh, yeah. I mean, I mean, because, you know, glamour season's over for us. It's yeah, now it's over 100 there, there I'm sure, uh, most of the time. So, uh, we want to get back to Pismo. It's, uh, it's that time of year. That's what we do during this time of year normally. So, hopefully, we can get to that soon. Anyway, car's getting closer. We uh, are going to finish the other side off camera because, I mean, it's the same as this side. You don't want to watch it twice. Uh, but here, I'll show you what the side looks like. Something like this. So here's the, you know, here's the lead uh, for the, here's the lead for the um, lighted whip. From here, all you see is this. Typical, normal. Back here. So we hit the wiring up under here. We got the ground right down in here, if you can see that. The other wiring over here is kind of as it was. And, and that's it. And then we got all these tools to pick up. But we're not going to pick those up until we until we do the rest of this, the other side. So, but that's it for this because, like I said, the other is the same. Other side is the same as this side. You don't want to watch it twice. So, don't forget, we really do, really, really, seriously appreciate um, all the people subscribing, all the comments, all the likes. It means a lot to us. It's growing. The channel's growing. We really do have some big stuff coming up. I know we keep saying it, but you, as you can imagine, in the middle of what's going on right now, it's hard for us to make progress on that. But um, the other thing is we've had some uh, big, big changes that uh, we weren't expecting. So um, we're not sure which way that those big changes were going. The car is going to go faster. This car, a car, a car, some car. A car is going to go faster than this car at some point soon. Whether it's something we work with a company on, whether it's something we buy, whatever we uh, end up deciding is what we're going to do. And uh, we're working on that now, trying to make a decision. So he's... So... Stay tuned on that. And again, we appreciate it. Thank you. Subscribe if you can. Like if you can. Comment. We love the comments. We're getting a lot a lot more comments. Uh, we try to stay up with them as much as we can. Brandy said peace. Danny said peace.